Hello and welcome back to Subnautica. Okay, let's go out and do a little bit of looting. I've made a few changes in the base. I'll just quickly run you through what I've done. Nothing new in the reactor room. Uh, nothing new in here, in fact. Uh, what have I got in this bag? Oh, extra water. We'll take that with us. Come in handy, I'm sure. So in here, I have put a shelf up and put the car, put the uh, Aurora miniature on this uh, bench here, removed the shelves that were on that wall and put two reinforcements and I put some uh, a window in. Put a window in here and a uh, an exit this end as well. A couple of reinforced walls, a couple of windows here and here where we can see the base in quite good detail. And then in here I've actually put a few windows too. So one either side and two on that back wall which gives us a nice a nice view out there. So there we can see the base quite clearly. Okay uh, so I think today what we are probably going to do is go and have a look what we can find with regards to the Lost River. Now, I can't remember exactly where this place is, I'll have to admit. Uh, we've got enough food. I'll put an extra water in there, I think, because uh, we've got extra food and those peepers. We've got two nutrient blocks. We don't need to keep um, an extra peeper in there. But I can't quite remember <laughs> exactly where this place is, so... Get in here. Now, off the top of my head, All systems online. I would say it is one end or the other of the Aurora. Now, whether that's a good guess, I don't know. But, seeing as though we are so close to the rear of the Aurora, but we had south southwest. See where we see where we end up. It's a little tricky travelling at night. We do have that big cloud there, which could be covering up the island. But we'll see. We'll see if we can find this place without looking it up on the internet. Because I shouldn't need to. Kind of head a bit more in a south direction, maybe. Hmm. Is that cloud moving there? That's it. Well, this might be wrong. Let's see where we end, where we uh, end up. <laughs> I think it's about a thousand meters out, maybe fifteen hundred meters. Okay, we found that a little bit quicker than I was expecting, so that's good. That's not rendered in in very, very much detail, is it? There we go. There's all the lights. And there are all of the protrusions. Uh, let's go down below there then. And we need to look for those glowing guides. Here we are. Okay. Yeah, the problem with this is those damn warpers. I really don't like those things, and we're gonna we're gonna run into them down here for sure. There's one already. Good grief! So let's try and avoid him. I really wish the game would give you a little bit of leeway when you uh, first enter an area like this. They really are quite the pain. I'm gonna go this way, see if we can avoid. Oh gosh, look at him! <gasps> Where are we? That's incredible, look at that! Oh, he's like, oh my gosh, he's like a big shrimp! Oh, he's weird looking. 
I mean, it's cool and everything, but my gosh. <gasps> Look at you. Oh, it's, it's really cool. Oh, he's turning around. He doesn't like me. Well, you can carry on. I don't want to get in your way. He's kind of stirring up all the ground, isn't he? I wonder if he's exposing resources. He is so cool, though. I think he's called a sea treader. This is the Grand Reef, okay. This isn't where I'm supposed to be, by the way. I wonder if there are any more anywhere. Do they attack you? Are they friendly? Should we try and scan him? He might not like me much doing this. Sea treader. Don't move. Don't poop on me either. actually poops. There's some sea treader poop. Should we pick it up? Oh. <laughs> I wonder what that's used for. It's got to have a use. Everything does in this game. Welcome aboard, Captain. We actually caught him pooping on camera. Is he stuck here? He shouldn't really be here, perhaps. I do like him though. There's a ruby. Can't believe we actually caught him pooping on camera. You pooped in front of viewers. He's really cool. Outside of the ship, I mean, he's quite he's quite happy with me being this close inside the ship. That's very interesting. That is an incredible, incredible close-up view of this creature. I love it. Scanning a few things, by the way. Rogue Cradle, Tidal Pound. Okay, exploitable. Creep Vine, Flora. Leviathans. Sea Trader Leviathan. Range of Sense. Thick Armour. Behaviour. Oh, is he getting. Oh, did he just... Hello. <laughs> what is this reading there? It's quite interesting. It's very cool though. I'm sure I need the poop for something, but... this was. Crater Edge. I, I kind of, I've been um, just uh, swim, well, um, cruising around in the um, sea moth for a little bit, but I didn't realise I'd uh, actually triggered all these things. Green Iron Sulfur Plant. I've been scanning a few things as well. 
these notifications. Is that all of them? Yep. There he goes. He's pooping all the way. I don't know if I should be picking this stuff up. I wonder what it's used for. It uses up quite a lot of space, doesn't it? Should we pick up a few and then if we don't need them we can just dump them and they'll remain in the, in the area. It's probably useful for plants more than anything. Yeah, we better put this back on, haven't we? There we go, otherwise it's going to get a bit confusing. Right, let's go down here then where we were heading. Turn the lights off because we don't want those um, warpers. I can hear a warper. I can most definitely hear a warper. Down here somewhere is the entrance to the Lost River. That's what we've come down here for. There's a warper. Quickly get out of here before they catch up with me. Grief. They don't leave you alone at all. Just want you to have a look. What's down here? Let's just swim around blindly for a little bit and see if we can find the place. Oh, look, I need that. Yep, definitely need that. Oh, there's some more there. Oh, there's, that was a wall for that way. Let's go this way. Ah, volcanic. This is sort of promising, isn't it? Oh, good God. What that happened? What happened there? Let's go back on this way. Oh jeez. Okay, we won't go that way. I don't want to be uh, ejected from my ship in this area. That's for sure. You're too hot. Uh, a lot of gel sack. get caught. I'm just trying to avoid those things. I'm going around in circles. I'm kind of right down in the, in the middle. Okay, we're not really getting to where I wanted to be. I have swung around a lot of that area. Let's try over this way. Oh, that sounds like that crab thing, a uh, squiddy thing. That seems like a, the right area then, doesn't it? <laughs> This isn't the area I'm thinking of. Yeah, this doesn't look that familiar. Oh, good gosh. Right, we're back down into this volcanic section again, which I don't think they want us to be near. You can hear those warpers all around there. more of those uh, crystals here. Oh, this is that area. Okay. Yeah, this is not where I want to be. But let's get these crystals because we, we need these for the, the reactor rods. There we go. Oh, and there's one down there as well. We'll try and get it in an odd number. How many have we got? We could probably do with two more, I think. 
we see an egg. Yeah, this is not where I want to be. Not where I was thinking I was. Ah, oh, maybe. Maybe it is. Hang on. Right. There's greenness. Is there anything in the bottom of these areas? We definitely need the green. Look for the green glow is a lot of tips for these areas. So green glow is good. Oh, good God. That's interesting. He's actually kind of walked away, hasn't he? We have found it. That's really cool. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. Right. Um, right, we've got some quartz. Uh, is there anything down in here? I bet that's a lump of whatever we need, isn't it? But we need some small pieces. Can we actually get out in here, I wonder? Oh no! Oh, no. no Welcome no. aboard, Captain. It's acidic. Yeah, don't, uh, don't do that then. Interesting. So I am going to need the prawn suit, aren't I, to gather this. This is not good. Very interesting. Okay. I wonder if we're even going to be able to get the uh, nickel that we need from here. Is this out in the ship, by the way? No, I don't think it is, is it? Oh, here's a big skull. Oh, and a... And a light. Very cool. Oh, that's really, really good. Let's have a look at uh, what I wanted to do was see whether this was anything we could pick up. That lump there uh, doesn't look like it. Let's get back inside. That. Is that the bit of nickel? We need a lot. Yes. Right. That's what I'm looking for. It's tiny. It's really difficult to see. And it doesn't look like there's a lot of it. Ah, there's some on the on the side of the wall. So that's that's good that it's there. any up here. Let's get back to the uh, get back to the ship maybe. Let's look around this side a little bit. We've got to get as much of this stuff as we can. We're gonna need it for upgrades. I don't remember that skull. 
being quite so vast. That's pretty incredible, isn't it? I do love this, uh, this game. Okay. Right, let's have a good scout around the uh, outside of this thing then. Ah, okay. There's that, um, we've been in this in the last season. There's that place. We need um, a tablet. Uh, where's the door? Where's the entrance? What tablet do we need? What colour? Orange, right. We need an orange tablet. So we'll come back here and do this. Um, where is home? The state of interest. Can we see our um, home marker? There we go. So, east. So we need to come west. There's a ruby. That's water. Right, okay. Okay, let's grab a ruby while we're here. Orange tablet. Let's see if we can find more nickel. Here's some. I do have my light with me, but I can see fairly well at the moment. So I want to draw attention to myself with all these funny creatures around me. I would like to scan one of those things though. Another bit of nickel. More ruby. Should we scan this and just keeps pop popping up, asking us to scan? And we'll scan this ruby as well because I don't think I've scanned the ruby before either. through this way. Let's get as much of this nickel as we can. I hope I'm not missing it. Um, 2, 4, 5 slots left. We could always drop one of these. Ah, let's see if we can scan one of these things. That's really something ray, a ghost ray. Nice. It's really struggling with the um, frame rate stuff. How much nickel have we got? Two, four, six. We're going to need a lot more than that, I think. Let's have a look around the rest of this chamber because it looks fairly safe in here, doesn't it? Let's save the game. Just because it's uh, it is starting to struggle. Plenty of ruby here. Plenty. Okay, we'll go up a little bit. This is this uh, corridor that we were just in. So we've seen some pretty cool stuff today. It's really struggling. Really struggling now. Let's put a light on, let's make sure we're not missing anything else. Whoa, okay. Let's 
check the other side. Mainly seen, as I say, ruby and not that much nickel. I wonder if it's under the, the green river. Might be. really hope I'm not missing obvious pieces, but I don't think I am. What a beautifully detailed area. Now we've got a signal here. <laughs> oh gosh. We have a signal. Terrain scans indicate this biome contains unusually high concentrations of organic and fossilised remains. Yeah, this is the main... Um, main chamber. Before we go in there, let's just double back around. Just make sure I haven't missed any nickel in this area because that other area has got a predator. I do love that skull. It's so, so intriguing. Okay. No, it's it's mainly the um, quartz, isn't it? Quartz and ruby. Oh, there's some. Pretty well hidden, but we uh, found it. Oh, there's the ship. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay. So that central portion looks empty. That is just a column. Come back here for that um, location that we can go in with the orange tablet, definitely. Which is just here in front of me now. Let's have a look on these walls. I don't think there is anything. <laughs> no, that's just the way that had rendered in then. That was really odd. I think what we should probably do is go out through that exit that we've just found, past the uh, that big leviathan, and try not to attract his attention too much. If we can, maybe stick to the edges. Uh, safely bank all of this uh, good stuff back at the base and come back here next time with an orange tablet and some empty uh, empty inventory space so we can collect some of these rubies and good stuff. Quartz is great down here. There's one. Look how that's tucked away right in there. Oh no, that's a lighted stone. Oh, interesting. Really looked like one. Can't uh, drop that inside the ship. I got, I got lost. Yeah, I have a little bit. If 
kind of loops around in a kind of a donut shape, doesn't it? It appears to anyway. This episode's been going on for, but I would very much like to get back. Right, so it's not going to be that way. <laughs> ah, I think it's this way, where it drops off the side over there. Over a cliff edge, doesn't it? So we'll have a quick look at this, but I'm not going to go in here and do anything because of that that thing is dangerous. Now let's wait for him to turn around. Maybe we'll go for this bit of nickel here. Oh it's sunstone again. Well we'll grab the lead. on here. He seems to be kind of hanging around that top section, doesn't he? I'm going to have to try and sneak past him somehow. Sneak past. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Right, let's dock it in here for a second. Whoa. They've done some work on this skeleton. Look, it's all creepy. Yeah, much, much improved. Oh, and there's some spiny things down there. I wonder if they're dangerous. There's some uh, nickel ore there to mine. Seen much to pick up on just pieces. I wonder if I've got all of what's available. I really want to swim down into that skull, but I think it would probably be a bad idea. Oh, here I am. Sitting right next to No, my sandstone aircraft again. You know what? I better break that because otherwise I'm gonna think. It's nickel the next time I come back. Let's go down into the skull. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No. Yikes. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Hello. You're all quite scary, aren't you? I'm not sure I like those very much. Okay, let's get the scanner out. Skeletal remains. Cool. Let's drink some water. The river Crown. Scan you fella. I don't care. Nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right, okay. Now I've lost sight of that wire thing unfortunately. I think we can sneak out this way. I don't remember the being quite so many of those prowdery things we didn't see last time. But the uh, the graphics have definitely been improved. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's sandstone outcrop again. There's some lovely waterfalls. Um... Oh, what's that there? Um, okay, 
let's not swim into the green stuff. That looks like my foot eye, yeah. That looks that looks like really cool, doesn't it? Yay. I think this this little section here is quite safe. It feels safer than round the other side. A little bit safer. Such a great spot. So we've got more ruby again. I think it was a good idea coming down here in this. Um, trying to come here in the side This is just so bulky. Um, I do need to bring the bronze suit down here though and do some mining probably. But I've never had much success with travelling around in the bronze suit so... Two waters left and two food. We could always drop these things and I've got some titanium to drop. Oh, diamond! I wasn't expecting that. All sorts of good things down here then. There goes that titanium. Everything looks a really funny colour down here. Gel sacks, we've got plenty of. I love all the uh, the glowing lights. Is that one or is that sandstone? That looks like a sandstone. More irregular shape. Is that something there? What exactly is that? That looks really dangerously close to that green stuff. Crystalline sulfur! <gasps> wow! Okay, that's good. Oh, can we find any more of you? Oh, I like that. I've got a diamond here. I didn't know this is where we found that stuff. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay. Right, let's have a, a good look around the edges of this then. I mean, if it's just over the boundary, I seem to be able to stand that close to it quite safely. That looks like some down there, doesn't it? Oh, should we risk doing this again? I'm gonna get burned. I'm gonna get burned. It's fine. Oh, let's use the health kit. Wow. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, let's not do that again. We need to use the. Um, Prawn suit for gathering that then. I really wanted another one because you can't, probably can't do anything with one but you can with two so usually sometimes you need three of course but that first one was very lucky it was just on the cusp of the um, that area. So it really is an acidic um, area. Let's hop out of the, um, this thing and repair because we've done a bit of damage going in the, uh, that green area I think. Look at these ribs, they're awesome. Is that some more there? That might be, um, Oh, yeah, of course. Another 
diamonds. What have we got left to storage? We've got two. Two left. Well, I think this one's going to be a really long episode today. Um, purely for the fact that I want to get home. Wow, look at this. There's another skeleton. skeleton. Water is like fresh water, isn't it? Hot, probably, but. Yeah, we're quite, we're quite deep, aren't we? Wow, look at this place. We need to go in there. Oh my god, I would die in there very easily. <laughs> This alien structure appears to have collapsed to the sea floor. Yeah, it has. Oh, warpers. Right, come on. I think I'm just going to head out of here now. We can easily come back this way and do some more exploring. Uh, but uh, I think I'm going back in, aren't I? away from the walkers which I quite like but I want to get back home and get some of this nickel put away and have a look at what we can make uh, we don't want to be going that way yeah I've got the wrong way let's get out of here this way then we are just moving so slowly Those look like purposeful, um, purpose-made steps for the, uh, for the prawn suit, don't they? Now I'm wondering which way is going to be the best way to get out of here. I'm looking for sort of lighter colour water. Oh dear, come on. Let's not uh, attract the attention of any of these things. Whoa, he battered me then. I'm gonna get stuck in here, aren't I? I should be able to get up to the surface this way. Oh, there's a warper. Don't like the sound of that. That's a dead end, okay. Good grief. How do you get out of here? This is a long, long journey out of here. This is heading back in, isn't it? Is it? Maybe not actually. No, this looks slightly different. Oh, maybe not. Oh well, if we have to go out the way we came, so be it. Mm, there's that thing. Yeah, let's go out the way we came then. Mm. See what we'll do. We will save. There's no way I'm losing all of this progress. No way. We'll scoot round the sides. Hopefully, you won't notice we're here. We're being very stealthy with the lights off. Maybe not stealthy enough. I've got to be careful actually. We're right on the limit of the uh, depth of this uh, sea moth.
This area has definitely been improved though. It was quite sparse before. Um, it was effective. I mean, it worked. It worked very nicely. Uh, I've got two spots left still. It's like a starry, starry sky. It's really nice. I'm going for that gap right in front of us, hoping that that. <gasps> Look! Wow! Oh, I love it. Look at him. He's fantastic. He's really cool. Okay, let's go for this gap then. Let's see if this is the way out or not. another one of these things here. It's a bit more broken up than the others. Oh, they've done such a great job. All of the extra lighting in these places just really adds. Yeah, I think we're I think we've made it. I think we've made it out. Gosh, there's a warper. The local scans show a nearby opening, leading to a biome with extensive fossilized remains. Uh, well, yeah. I can't tell if I'm going up or down at the moment. Let's go up to the surface. Where the hell am I? Where is my home? Oh, we're in the Kush zone. So we, oh, okay. Oh, good God. Oh, well, this is one of the Kush zones. I don't know if it's a... Uh, there are more than one. Well, that was really, really um, interesting area to explore. I really enjoyed that. Where are we? Yeah, Kush zone. Oh, listen to that noise. That was fantastic. I really, yeah, I'm so glad we've managed to get all of that nickel. Well done, little sea moth. Well done, little geek. <laughs> oh gosh, I know where we are now. We don't really want to be around here either. Let's get. Get away from the Leviathan that lives in this area. Oh gosh, it's taken us in a direct route. We better be careful, I'm going to be sensible and just scoot round the side. It's a bit of salt, what are you? A bit of lead. I usually feel safe when there are these uh, reef bags around. Yes. They're friendly and they uh, they seem to live in the friendlier areas of the uh, of the map. Oh. Pretty awesome loot. Uh, we've got enough for another rod, we've got plenty of the nickel ore, we've got a couple of rubies, and we've got some sulfur, which is awesome. And there's one other item that I'm really not sure where to go for it. Um, we'll have a look when we get back. But hopefully this means we'll be able to upgrade the prawn suit. Um, load it into Big Geek, the Cyclops, and then head down that way and do a bit of a uh, bit of mining, maybe. Although I'm not sure we're going to need it. Um, sort of depends, I suppose. 
depends what the story wants us to do next. So here are all the windows, you can see it looks fantastic. There's a look inside the base. I love that. You can see right down the corridor to the end there. Nothing docked, written very clearly. Got that corridor there. I need to put some more windows in really. I need to put a window in here and one on the end. But let's dock this first. And get all our lovely loot stashed away safely. Wow, what a what a what a day. <laughs> that was awesome. We need to let that really recover. Let um, the charge needs to be recharged. Uh, okay, we've got a, a signal as well. Um, right, let's put this stuff away first. Um, yeah, we've got a couple of bits of lead. Where are we going to put nickel? I'm going to put it in with the silver and dot. No, we don't have room. Let's put the ruby away. We've got lots of ruby. We could put the sulfur in there and the nickel. I think that's a brilliant haul. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that. Uh, now, there is somewhere where I have... Yes, here they are these crystals and we also picked up one magnetite which was really good as well let's eat let's drink and let's go and grab water and salt and get that uh, crank in again and I think this is an ideal spot but to uh, leave the episode we've got a, a message to read next time we've got some upgrades to do so all that remains for me to do is to thank you so much for watching i've really enjoyed that one uh, until next time take care and i'll see you again soon bye for now